United have released um, images of the up and coming kit for this season, obviously, naturally. Um, every season there's a new kit, every season there's a new design, kids are having to rush out to buy it. And every season we are generally disappointed with the performance of United in the league, or in general, in terms of, you know, not being able to win trophies and having to somehow, you know, legislate that despite us not winning a trophy, somehow this never the manager's fault. But regardless, we move. The kit itself has been met with some level of derision between the United fan base I think a lot of people don't really like it personally myself I don't normally buy United kits anyway in general um, because of the whole Glazer stuff I try to make it possible that I'm not putting any money in those guys pockets but you know again you know it's a global force a global brand um, I'm pretty much sure my little strike that I'm doing preventing me or where I'm not buying any sort of club merch isn't necessarily making driving home any points especially when the fan base is so divided as it is so I was thinking to myself oh I do need to add a kit to my arsenal of jerseys because most of mine I had prior I've already given them away I'm not exactly the kind of person I like walking around with a football, football jersey on unless I'm actually playing football i'm not one of these kind of four kit wankers you know it's not, it's not something i do but when i did see these images leaked of this new united kit i did quite like it because of why people hate it it sort of looks like a pro sports type of jersey right sort of like something that you would make on a blank you know back in the day there were these companies that did blank football jerseys that you could you know um put your sunday league badge on into whatever it may be and they'd have these kind of really basic designs like canvases that you'd use and then every team basically had the same you know let's say three to five designs but just different color combinations and then obviously with your emblem or whatever it may be and maybe the numbers are different but in terms of the design of the shirt it was all the same and it sort of looks similar to that so it's obviously vintage inspired but i like the plain nature of it um obviously the white collar here is a bit of a problem when you're playing football you're going to be sweating a lot you're probably going to be using this collar to wipe some of the sweat on your chin or your face so this is going to get really yucky and brown and whatnot very very quickly but you know you'd hope that you're mostly going to wear them maybe when you're only doing you know when you're watching the game so you're not gonna be sweating too tough but i'd think for me personally i'd like to wear it you know again playing you know your five side game here and there um again i quite like that so the design overall apart from the contrasting white color even though you could probably make it red to make it tonal but it probably wouldn't look as nice as it does so it's probably a little stylistic choice there and then you've got the top of course worn itself in long sleeve in my opinion looks really cool i know some people don't like it because it just it does look a little bit plain and a little bit basic but I like it in that respect because it doesn't look too much like a football jersey. There's nothing worse, like I said, than wearing a football top and not playing football, especially if you're watching it on a live stream or something and you're screaming and shouting at your computer. You just look like an absolute weapon, in my own opinion. But with this, you sort of get the balance. You get a kind of your training kit, you know, sort of vibe. And you also let people know that you're obviously supporting the team that you're actually wearing at that particular time. Unless, of course, you're Brendan Shaw and you own every jersey of every team <laughs> that ever existed because of some weird, weak connection you have with them. But yeah, I quite like it, man. You know, the white cuffs are quite nice. Again, the white thing, the white shorts. Like, it's, I wouldn't wear the shorts or the socks or anything, but the shirt on, on its own, I quite like it. I think it looks really, really good. So that might be the first jersey I end up copying um in a few years i think the previous one might have been one of our ones from like 2014 15 season or something i forgot when po rodrigo possible was at the club that's probably the last jersey i owned and i've actually got i actually had one with rio ferdinand's number on it that i had signed but i ended up giving that away as well um but yeah pretty decent jersey i'll definitely end up purchasing that i'm actually a fan of it i, I think you know maybe one of the only united fans that would wear the new jersey especially when you'd see what happens on social media in terms of the reception that's definitely received so i'm looking forward to getting that